Hey guys, Ryan here from Rocket Outdoors. Thanks for tuning in again. Uh, I'm going to do something a little different today. Um, I'm here editing up some footage that I recorded over the last few days um, of me and me and Fitchick um, walking in the woods. Uh, I'm doing a two part video, short two part video. Um, and I guess it kind of hits on the paranormal. Uh, I'm not usually into that kind of thing. I mean, I'm a, I'm a skeptic, and I always try to find logical reasons for things, but this is just kind of weird. And uh, if you guys watch, I just want to get your take on it and tell me what you think about it. Um, just to give you a little bit of uh, insight on what's going to happen. Um, the first day, me and Fitchick are just walking in the woods, and it's it's a pretty normal day. Um, we do get these moments where we actually said to each other, this is a weird place. Like, it's very beautiful. And at first, we thought everything was fine. And then later, as the day progressed, we just got a weird feeling about it. Um, and I had taken a bunch of footage that day. And I took one picture on my phone. And after getting home, realized that there's something very strange in the picture. Um, it seems like there's a blue orb in the woods. Um, that's kind of unexplainable. Um, at first, I thought, oh, it's a reflection. It's this, that. But looking at it, there's, you know, you can see it in the woods and there's like branches and trees in front of it blocking its view. And then there's trees behind it that, that are blocking the view of the trees. So just really strange. Um, and ever since that moment, my camera, my camera footage is all messed up, distorted, blurry. Um, my settings were like changing on their own. It was really weird. Um, the next morning, I decided I gotta go back out there and check it out. So the second video um, will be me going out by myself. Um, I found the exact spot where I took the photo and walk into the woods. I actually set up camp and cooked some lunch right where it seems like the orb was in the woods um, and took a bunch more photos. And when I got home yesterday, uh, my camera was messing up again. And the last photo that I took before I left that camp spot has another orb in it. And it's almost weirder than the first one. So, I don't know. <laughs> um, I also did some research and there's an article about, there's a pond about a little, maybe a little more than a quarter mile away through the woods. Um, and there's a stream that comes out of it that runs right by that spot. Um, people say that they see orbs hovering above the pond, above the water. Um, and it's a pretty common thing. And they've been seeing it for years and years and years. So, which I was like, oh my God, <laughs> like this is, this is freaky. So I'd love to go back there and investigate more. I don't know if I'm going to because I was literally, I was scared out there. And I don't get like that in the woods. I mean, I've been in the woods my whole life and I feel more comfortable in the woods than I do in the city. But something about that place. So stay tuned and uh, check out the video. Please give me your thoughts on it. Um, maybe after you watch the first part and the second part will be up like, this one should be up today or tomorrow and then the other one will be the following day. Um, and I'm gonna put the pictures in there, everything. So take a look, tell me what you think. All right guys, let's roll. Hey guys. Ryan here from Rocket Outdoors. Thanks for tuning in once again. Um, we got a late start today. So we just decided to hit some local forest area and uh, take a little walk in the woods. You know, walk for a few miles, get some exercise. It's a beautiful day. So that's the plan. Yeah, we're out here in um, Hampstead, New Hampshire. Uh, there's a Moore's Trail and Cemetery Loop. Cemetery. It's a few miles. There's, I think there's like 15 miles of trails out here or something. Never been here before. So, I'm just going to take a walk around, try not to get lost, and uh, do a little exercise. Stick around.
Zoom in on my damn face. <laughs> Look at this. Holy Road. Uh -oh. West Road, Governor's Island Road. Hi, big chick. <laughs> stop. <laughs> what are you doing? You're staring like I'm getting like ready. I'm creeper. getting ready. Just stop talking so I can start. <laughs> So he's possessed. You're possessed? Oh, this camera is. No, I think it's you. You're possessed. You're possessed. What? Is that? what? I don't know. There's noise. Why are you looking at me? <laughs> Waiting for Lindsay to tie her shoe again. <laughs> Look at that double knot. <laughs> I started doing some research about this area and there's a pond. There's all kinds of streams and stuff that come through here. There's a pond called Wash Pond that is connected to these streams um, and it's very close. It's probably about a quarter mile that way. Um, there's articles about it saying that at night you can see blue orbs uh, hovering over the water. Um, and they say that it's very common to see this. So, I don't know. Kind of weirded out. So, I'm out here today and I'm going to try to find that exact spot where I took the picture and walk into the woods and try to find that exact spot where the orb seems to be. I'm just checked out. And I brought some lunch with me, an alcohol stove. I'm gonna cook up a little bit of food, maybe in that, in that specific spot, and see what happens. So, I don't know, stay tuned. <laughs> 